Number three, drop everything that holds you back. Drop weight and run free. Now, this particular picture is sort of like, it's, it's an exaggerated uh, situation, but maybe not for some of you. Some of the junk you're carrying with you, it looks that bad. To me, that reminds me of a dung beetle. Anybody know what a dung beetle is? Spends its lifetime rolling around on the African plain, rolling a ball of manure with his hind legs, with his front legs, and he's just pushing it along. And he carries his manure with him at all times. Believe me, he doesn't go home, leave home without it. He eats it. He sleeps with it. He carries it around. Sort of looks like that. Uh, you can go on the internet or go to the library and look up a dung beetle and see if, if, if that doesn't match the way some people carry around their manure. The Bible says this. Hebrews 12. You think I'm being crude. Hebrews 12, verse 1. Let us also lay aside every weight and every sin, and sin is as ugly as dung, which clings so closely to us. Let's lay it aside, get rid of it, and let's run with patience the race that is set before us. Here we're back to this race again. We need to run. You can run with a, a little bit of weights just to get warmed up, to practice running up some hills. But do you know what? In life, believe me, you don't have to do a lot of practice. For, sufficient unto the day is the evil thereof. In every, in your life, you will come across things that will work your legs and make your legs burn. You don't have to end up picking up weights to, to make sure that you're strong enough. Let them go. Just run the, the, the race of life. You know, it's going to be about this time next week. I won't be in church here. I will be hiking in Alaska. And if I want to reach the most beautiful spots in this state closest to heaven, I will need to make sure that I remove from my backpack everything I do not absolutely need. I'm not going to bring three sizes of skillet to make sure that we can fry the salmon and trout we're going to be catching. Well, I might want to have this one just in case. No way. I am going to, maybe I might even just bring a little bit of a thin little, little uh, rack to put the salmon fillets on as I roast it over the fire and hope the bears don't come. All right? I am going to remove from my pack everything that I don't absolutely need so that I can reach the heights with this old body. All right? I should have dropped more weight, but I probably will come back a little thinner. You need to lay aside every weight in your life, every sin. What is it that you cling to? What is the ball you walk around and drag? What do you carry that keeps you from, ke from breaking stride in God? I challenge you, lay it down, because you are not going to be able to get the heights in God. You are not going to be able to win, win the race near the front of the pack as long as you keep dragging some of the stuff that you've got in your back pocket. Let it go.